Welcome morning gentlefolk and welcome to the next episode of Let's Play Crusader Kings 2 as uh, the former uh, Kingdom of Wessex. Um, we are now uh, a dual Countess. We are the uh, Countess of Winchester and the Countess of Wiltshire. So things have moved on. Um, our King, the King of... Uh, uh, he's now the King of Scotland with a K. Um, is at war with the King of Mercia. Um, so we don't want to be losing any of our newly and hardly gained and hard gained territory. Um, we do have trouble with the line of succession because it will be divided because of our agnetic cognatic gavel kind law. Um, so uh, we will be needing to change that at some point. So let's kick it off and see what happens. So uh, we do we have we have a weak claim on the county of Somerset, a weak claim on the county of Dorset, weak claim on the county of Sussex, weak claim on the county of Oxford, and a weak claim on the grand city of Gloucester. So uh, whose butt can we kick next? I do think I need Cassus Belli for a lot of these now. Uh, Pope Pelagius III has died and been succeeded by Pope Constantine. Well, as I said in the previous episode, uh, he probably was mad. <laughs> Elder Scrolls people will understand that one. So, I can't declare war on you? No. And, I can't declare war on you? No. So, I'm going to have to fabricate claims somewhere. So, who's next? Right, let me just pause this. The dragon bows of long ships have been sized off the coast of Dorset. Okay, so... Oh, look! I can now vase rat... Va vase? I can now raise... <coughs> I can vase va... <laughs> I, can, I can raise vassal levies. Woot! Uh, okay. not enough is it Prince Bishop Franken of Liège from Britain Abe Wolf is no longer Spymaster okay well, we better, suppose we better sort that out haven't we oh dear oh, oh dear oh dear Swafford your name creeps up a lot Swafford it really does Go on, break them, break them. Yay! Victory is mine. Bulk figure Cossage Koss daughter has been imprisoned by King Sidric of Scotland. At the age of 49, Edwolf has died bedridden and infirm. And that was what we read previously. So, uh, so that went well. Okay, so we saw the, uh, saw the riding nords off. I climb the highest trees, visit graveyards at midnight to collect spiders and snakes. It makes me feel alive. Countess Sigrid of Winchester gains a trait brave. Excellent. King Sigtrig of Scotland has created the Yaldum of Huys. So, what are we going to do with our Chancellor? <gasps> oh, excuse me. Um, uh, hello. Um, you are uh, sieging my castle there, uh, young man. Um, to be fair, there's probably not a lot I can actually do about it. Um, send your troops south. Anyway, that's what, what are we going to do with our Chancellor? Who are we going to fabricate claims on? Um... Oxford would be lovely. Um, as you all fabricate claims on Oxford. Uh, 
Well done. I approve. <clears throat> so. Right then, what can we purchase? We can build castle, for, castle walls. Uh, I shall build some castle walls while I can afford to. In Wiltshire. Any potential? Oh, Louis the Cat, Louis, <laughs> Louis King of West Francia, Francia, Arnold King of Bavaria, Yildbirds King of Brittany, Ludwig King. Of... Matrilineal marriages. Oh, Ikov, Prince of Bulgaria, heir to the Kent of Nicopoli. Mind you, he is a, he's an Orthodox. Prince of Greater Moravia. Who's the grand old age of zero? Matthews, Prince of Greater Moravia. Then Franco, courtier. Hmm. Willem. Hmm. So these people would agree to a matrilineal marriage. Iglos, Magistros of Paphlagonia. Okay. <coughs> Brilliant strategies, Defender, Scott. Hmm. Cynical. It started off well, hasn't he? Been cynical at age eight. Hmm. Okay. Worth keeping an eye on. So what do we have? Bishops. Uh, yes. I don't feel too well. Something's wrong with me. I'm. Oh, please kill me. Oh God. I'm. I'm ten and I'm ill. This. I have three vassals now. Swavid, Edelbert, and Balthair. Okay. <clears throat> oh, age 29, more died in the dungeon of King Cedric of Scotland. Well. So I'll get confused because the flag of Mercia is very similar to the flag of Scotland. Uh, in modern times, so I keep thinking this is Scotland, while obviously it isn't then. <laughs> King Dunmar III of Cornwall. King Scotland has created the Yaldum of Kent. Oh, my beloved mother Hildegard is concerned that she's still not married. Oh, I'll find my mother someone nice. Let us have a perusal. Let us see. Oh, she's got to marry Louis, King of West Fran... Uh, I'm West France is... Basically the Holy Roman Empire. The Albers, King of Brittany. Ludwig, King of East Frank. No, West Frank here is France, isn't it? So East Frank here is... Uh, yes. Kifo, King of Nubia. Vladimir, Duke of Vidin. Arnold, Duke of Bavaria. Hmm. You have a lot of choices, young lady. Mind you, you are only 29. Uh, I need to send you off somewhere weak, so because I'll probably have a weak claim on a couple of my counties. So, County of Upper Silesia. Well, I'll go to County of Chartres. I don't like... Uh, I'm not, not going to like marry you off to the King of West Francia or something. It, or East Francia. Duke of Tuscany. No, so basically it came to something. I don't want to. 
He's a bit young at 11, I feel. Robert Counter Shot. He's Graham and shy, glutinous, and slothful. He wants to get married. I couldn't get an alliance out of this anyway, so. <coughs> Linfredo, Duke of Sousa. Oh, she would accept that. There you go, I found you someone nice. Okay. Hildegard Carling is no longer guardian of Leola Ethelred's daughter. Okay. So I'm gonna accept person can get excellent. Okay, so a child needs educating. Educate my child, which is me, probably. Uh, Swafed, if only you had better stats. Proud, deceitful. Cruel, chase, it's probably not a good idea. Diligence, good. Spotted warrior. Content, no, wrath. Crap, no. Depressed. Apparently, but he's chased. Shy, humble, oh dear, oh dear. Mom, come back. <laughs> Depressed, cynical. Uh, well, I mean, yeah, cynical, just brave. Charismatic. I think it was Wolf went with before, wasn't it? So, Wolf. Oh, another child. No. At least we're making a bit more money. So, um, where are we fabricating claims on? Oxford. My lead, since I arrived in Winchester, there's never been a shortage of soldiers. Well, let us hope so. I must confess, when I hear this tune, it reminds me of Kenneth Branagh's version of Henry V. Fever is gone and my nose is dry, the headache is long gone and I feel alive again. Alive! Yes, uh, this, um, it uh, reminds me of uh, Kenneth Branagh's version of Henry V after the Battle of Agincourt, when he's walking across the... if anybody's seen this, of course. When he's walking across the battlefield and he's carrying the children and all the dead and, and through the, the mock and the mire and uh, and everybody just suddenly breaks into uh, non nobis and, and there's all singing and rejoicing and everybody's really depressed <laughs> but uh, uh, but because it's the same tune it does remind me of that people are no fools laughing dancing and nodding like puppets to the false tune played by priests and noblemen charlatans all it is all pointless it's still against the trade it's all po why am i bothering it's just hopeless so yes so there we go yes sir that's we want to have kenneth branner or oh, sir kenneth branner i should say Yes, so the war against Mercia is finished. Can't declare war on... Well, that's King Burgard of Mercia. Oh, I thought it was serious. Then looked, oh, I can declare war on the cla to claim Warwick. I can declare war to claim Warwick. Castle Wall's been built in Wilton. Woot! Y'all, Alfred of Wessex. Wait! Wait! But right before... Cos Copsage daughter has been released from King Cedric of... Okay. Y'all, Alfred of Wessex has created the Duchy of Wessex. Okay. So, I have a claim on uh, King Bugrid of Mercia. Well, I can claim it for your steward. King si Drag of Scotland has created the Aldom of Galloway. Prince Bishop Franklin of Leeds has people being released and Ward has contracted smallpox to actually away. Um 
taking Reese of Dehabath. I have no claims anyway there. Old enough? No. I have an ally. In Alfred of Wessex. I was going to suggest perhaps marry him, but uh, yes, he's my cousin. Declare war on you, can I? King Rodrigo II, the Great of Gwynedd. No. King Siegfried I of Jovik. I haven't checked the religious map. Norse pagan. Well, irony. The, the, the Walden <laughs> The Waldenesian heresy is appeared in the province of Dunbar. Heretics Where is you sir? You can go and proselytize in in Sussex, no. Of course I don't have anything to do with those provinces. Well all's well in mine. Ish kind of a bit. Catholic Christian, yeah. I'm that's what I'm going to get him to. Yes, I'm going to get him to proselytise in... Uh... I need to pause it. Milsex. No, can't declare war on you, sir. No. Sussex. No. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. It's fine, he's North Camp, Lord Svang. I can declare war to claim Sussex. I can claim it for my sister. I can claim it for myself. You have any allies? You don't. I have you my military. My military is ish. A bit, kind of. Hmm. That's probably worth a quick save. Right then, Sussex, you're going to feel my wrath. He doesn't like us anyway. Okay, so that's that sense. I shall uh, get everybody. Catch him. Oh. Hopeless. They're all hopeless. Come on, join together. Come on, thank you. Right. Uh, here and well, Bjorn's fine. You can go as well. Offer. So, well, yeah, okay. We have no other choice. So, offer it is. I shall offer, offer a flank. Well done. Oxford, try and finish him off.
Oh, hello. Off the tower was captured in battle and is now my prisoner. Perfect. Well, at 33. He's... Right, can I... Prisoners, can I ransom you off, sir? No. Well, I'm not going to worry about just 33 of you. I'm going to go and siege. Every day, the cook chases me out of the kitchen. But not before I've stuffed myself in my pockets full of biscuits. Came to Sigurd of Winchester going straight gluttonous. Oh, Marvellous. Oh, <laughs> the king has declared war somewhere as well. King Siegfried of Scotland has declared Scottish conquest of Strathern in Princess Cons Prince Constantine of Scotland. Okay. Holding in Vulture is on the siege. It kind of is, but it isn't. A holding in Winchester is on the siege. Again, it kind of is, but it isn't. Mehrain of Diffin has been released from Olaf of Diffin's dungeon. Okay. Uh. Yeah, Alfred I of Wessex has founded the Independence Faction. Well, that might be all very good and well, but uh, well, I don't think we're going to be assaulting. No. Flan McConnane has been imprisoned by King Sigrid of Scotland. Okay, my prisoner, uh, so let him rot for now. Come on. Break them down. King Sigrid of Scotland has created the title Yaldum of Lothian. Yes, I know my vassal levies have been up a long time. See, we'll have three counties then, and we'll have more attack base income. Okay, it's 49, it's still has died in the dungeon. Oh, my, my prisoner's died. Mind you, we, we couldn't ransom him off anyway. Lord of God has become a spy master for Robert Capet. Okay, that's okay. My lead, since I arrived in Winchester, there has never been a short. No, no, well, let us hope so that there's never is a shortage of troops. Right, we were about to break this siege, I think. Victory in Arendelle, 100%. Right, sir, I offer you terms on. I, I offer you terms on my peace. The Winchester and Clam Sussex War has ended. Countess Sigurd of Winchester has won. Yay! And so I can st stand you all down. Right, pause. Sigurd of Wessex has become Countess of Sussex. Well, we, we're expanding nicely. We're uh, doing our stuff, as it were. So far, things aren't going too bad at all. A few more uh, allies. Not allies, yeah, not attached course. That's no good. Vassals is what we... Vassals, that's... Right, so you don't like... Well, that's... Uh, that elf guy, you don't like me because of the usual subject. Female ruler, female air short reign. And Swafford, you've never liked me at all. 
Um, but you're close to liking me more than the Pope. Interesting. Interesting. Right then, gentlefolk. Um, I think that's probably, again, another good spot to um, cut this episode. Uh, more gains. We have gained the county of Sussex. Which is excellent. So, uh, more tax income. We now have three counties. Um, hopefully we can become uh, can, can we become a female yarl? Um, I don't know. But uh, so far things are progressing quite nicely actually. Even though we aren't Wessex anymore. We, we're now just uh, a countess in the, the Kingdom of Scotland with a K. Um, but all, all seems to be going well. So uh, with that uh, I thank you for watching. You all take care of yourselves. And with that I shall bid you farewell. And goodbye. <laughs>